report for today. We're expecting sunny weather with occasional bursts of gunfire. Please remember to review your mission briefings before disembarking. On behalf of the Earth Defense Force, I wish you a pleasant stay in Rome. So, we're gonna rendezvous with a priest. Yep. Because he knows where to find the Ark of the Covenant. Yep. Which contains the Holy Grail. Yep. Which is an alien artifact. Yep. So, we have to go to the Vatican. Yep. Uh... That's AAA, rookie. Get used to it. I don't know. This is some Da Vinci Code, man. Huh. You don't like the Da Vinci Code, Sam? Nah. Why not? Some good theories in there. No literary merit. So, um, uh, who's your favorite writer? Uh, Philip K. Dick, I guess. Philip K. Dick? Wait, Sam reads books? Guys, guys, you got incoming! Sam? Anyone? I'm here. What's happening? We got hit hard. Convoy's FUBAR. Gotta regroup and get out of here, or get out of here and regroup, whatever. Casualties? Driver's dead. Rookies. I'm alive, I think. So, Rookie, what's your name? Kenneth, sir. All right, Kenny, relax. We're gonna kill us some aliens. Did you miss me? Cause I didn't miss you. Sir, um, I think my gun broke. Don't worry, kid, I got this covered. Uh, sir, these Octanian Harvester Leviathans are a lot bigger than I imagined. It's not the size, kid, it's how you use it. I once killed a clear with a nail clipper. These things, are they? Yep. The processed. Humans turned into cannon fodder for Mitchell's horde. Cute, aren't they? How... how can we help them? Apply bullets as needed. Oh, yeah! I could really use a gun. Copy that, but this is a toy for big boys. Now, you can also take out the canar with your bare hands, but for larger groups, go for a shotgun or assault rifle. If I had a gun, a gun. And remember, kid, belchers explode, so stay clear of their barf radius. Barf radius? Look, it's not a scientific term, but it works for me. Sir, if I remember correctly, the map in the mission briefing showed an EDF storage facility just over this wall. Huh, maybe I should start reading that stuff. Nice! Um, could I have a gun now? You know, it's funny, but usually when I pick up one of these things... Ah, there they are! Why won't that gate open? Because it is an advanced automatic security gate, of course. Who is that? It is I, Professor Gottlieb Kiesel, your scientific advisor. Guten Tag. Does he always call in at random like that? I think he just gets bored. Oh, look! 
It's an angry steak. Why are these cows so angry? Bad cow! Oh, bad cow! Bullseye! Uh, looks like that was the last of them. The gate's open now. Oh, a harvester drone. I is, is that how they turn us into the processed? Yep. Mothership sucks you up, spits out a tentacle brain killing machine. I guess mental's really into recycling. Sam, I'm getting a signal from Father Mikhail. I'll upload the coordinates to your Nitrixa. All right. One ecclesiastical extraction coming right up. Ecclesiastical extraction? Good one. Oh, sir, I recognize that thing. It's a scrapjack. Let me take it apart so you can have a closer look. I thought there was supposed to be convoy. I am the convoy. Hi, I'm Kenny. Hellfire, we're ready for extraction. I'm picking up Rodriguez and Jones at the Piazza della Repubblica. Meet me there? It's a date. Father, grab your stuff. Let's not keep the lady waiting. I have my shotgun and my faith, son. I am already packed. So, Father, you came all this way from Russia to find the Holy Grail? Yes. Technically, like Catholicism, Holy Grail is heretical. But this is no time for dogma. Each must do all he can to save planet. Is that a giant metal space snake? Yep. Oh, I see. Good. That's good. An update on the Tunguska Offensive. As previously reported, the EDF front has been pushed back further toward Irkutsk. We now know that troops were recalled to participate in an attack on Angarsk, which was aimed at the destruction of the portal. We lost some ground, but at least now the enemy can't teleport straight up our noses anymore. Losing ground might sound like a bad thing, but let's keep in mind that Siberia is a big place with not a whole lot in it. So, let them have it if they want it so bad. The point I'm trying to make here, folks, is that we need to pick our battles carefully. If we lose this war, that's it for planet Earth. That's it for us. No more second chances. So if retreating toward Irkutsk is what we need to do today, let's do that. So we can gain ground again tomorrow, all right? I sense evil presence. Is your priest sense tingling? No. I just see pale corpses and floating objects. Sir, it's an organ hemovore. It's a vampire, Kenny. Should have packed holy water. So long, suckers! Forgive me. I almost made Stanley to Heaven joke. You are forgiven, Father. Oh, wow! What a lovely view! Planet Earth, baby! There's no place like it. I would like to 
to urge you to consider the subject of hope. Hope is an intellectual anomaly common in the lower species. A primitive belief that somehow, against all odds, the inevitable can be averted. This self-delusion, this disease, is deeply rooted in your culture. Your myths, your legends, all oh, your fudge grand nuggets. narratives I got something in my shoe. are infected with it. This is the true cause of your suffering, of your inability to embrace the One Infinite. You sons of bitches! I'll fuck metal! I'll fuck your whole army! Come at me, you alien pendejos! You want Mexican? I got Mexican! You want American? I got American! Y'all wanna bite me? Come get your chile con carne! What he said. Sam, nice to see you in one piece. Yeah, yeah. Never been so glad to see your ugly face, cabron. Hey, where's the rookie? I really wish I had a gun! Catch! Oh, I, I lost my shoe. Nice shot! Crap one-liner, though. I wasn't trying to do a one-liner. I lost my shoe? Dude, that doesn't even make sense. Should have said surprise. Just as you turned around. That would have been sweet. I, I was just trying to survive. I wasn't... This is triple A, boy. You gotta survive with style. See, a good one-liner would have been... Uh, could we do this later? This looks like a combat situation. Sometimes I wish I was back at university. Of course, it exploded and then fell out of orbit. So, Kenny, you should have gone for an odd joke. Always good with Gnar. I see you! I bet you didn't see that coming. But... Hey, Kenny, I got a good one for you. Ragnarok! <laughs> that does not work. Better than I lost my shoe. I lost my shoe. Hey, Kenny, you come up with a good one-liner yet? Or are you still waiting for the other shoe to drop? Rodriguez, cut him some slack. He's new. He'll learn. Good work, guys. Okay, time to break out the big guns. What, the minigun? But that's Hellfires. You know what she's like about people taking her stuff. Nah, she won't mind if I take it. Is no one going to comment on the fact that a giant metal space tank just burst out of the ground? What was it doing down there? When I was told I would fight power of something, I did not think it would be so Hey, Joan! Wanna bet I kill that thing first? Oh, you wanna owe me money that bad? Be my guest. Hey, Jones, remember when we killed that wyvern in Tokyo? Technically speaking, it was a basilisk, but it died just the same. That, my friends, is an ex-snake. Technically speaking, it's an ex-basilisk. Shut up, Rodriguez!
Did you miss me? You're right on time. Hey, Carter, what's new? Did you know this exact same model of bus was used in the assassination attempt on the Italian Prime Minister's personal ufologist in 2052? Now, most people say it was the Illuminati, but I'm pretty sure it was the CIA. Your tax money at work. Why did I even ask? Ladies and gentlemen, the express bus to anywhere but here is now departing. Want me to drive? I don't trust your driving, Stone. Remember what happened in Oslo? Hey, that nun came out of nowhere. You know what's funny? Today's my birthday. Damn, I didn't get you a present. Step on it, we got bonies on our tail. Ezekiel went to the Valley of Bones. And the Lord said to him, can these bones live? And Ezekiel said, O oh Lord, they will obey your commands. And that's how you do it. Thank you for rescuing me, friends. You're welcome, Father. But we still need to get you into the Vatican Library. All right, team. Give me some options. Rome's sealed tighter than a virgin's buttocks. Uh, sorry, Padre. Um, uh, wheels are out. Hellfire, what about wings? No way. It's like the annual Octanian Raider convention up there. Toyline Hellfire is correct. Unless Vesuvius were to erupt, enemy control of the airspace will remain absolute. Yes, yes, that's it. But we'll use Vesuvius, just like in 2010, when they used HARP to trigger that volcano in Iceland and brought down all air traffic in Europe to stop the Illuminati from getting out of Belgium. Ridiculous! The HARP is the high frequency active aurora research program. It is not an earthquake machine. No, oh, well, that's what they want you to think. Nonsense! I would know about such a device. Actually, it is an earthquake machine. Verdammt! Uh, wait, I'm right? Yes, I knew it. And now he'll never shut up. Thanks. We called it Project Rock and Roll, a powerful experimental <laughs> weapon designed to provoke seismic activity. It hasn't been used in years. But I've got the access codes. But sir, the targeting system is down. We need to manually place beacons to realign the satellite. Then the team just won an all expenses paid trip to beautiful Pompeii. It's crazy. It's impossible. I love it. Let's do it. Sam, I need the team to place eight beacons. I've uploaded the target locations to your Nitrixa. Okay, guys. All we need to do is take these doodads to their designated locations. Rodriguez, you go north. Kenny, west. Jones, do the stadium. I'll take care of the south. And you know the drill. Last one back pays for drinks tonight. Yep. On it, moving out. <sighs> I'll be in the car. Hey, Hellfire. What's it like being on the ground again? Kind of boring. Why do I keep running into locked doors? Bad luck. You're always going the wrong way. Doors hate you? Increased security in war zones? I am I the only one who knows you shouldn't answer a rhetorical question? <laughs> no, sir, I... Oh. I got a bone to pick with you. All clear. That was me killing a clear, by the way. See, Rookie, that's how you do a one-liner. And he didn't even lose his shoe. <sighs> hey, Hellfire, is it true about you and Sam? Is what true? You did it in a helicopter while fighting off harpies over Beijing. Don't be stupid, Rodriguez. Hey, it's just what I heard. There were no harpies in Beijing, you moron. You believe everything you're told? Sorry, sorry. Did I tell you how my goatee got its nickname? Do I want to know? Mm-mm. 
Never let him tell you that story. Ever. Hey, Hellfire. What? Rodriguez, shut up. To get any news out of France after the comms network collapsed during the Battle of Paris. But we've finally managed to contact some of our sources. We've been told that the bulk of Lord Ackerman's troops is starting to move out of the capital, presumably to aid the forces occupying the south, which have been debilitated by constant attacks from the French resistance. In Paris itself, the local infrastructure is in ruins, with survivors struggling to find food and clean water. EDF relief efforts are underway, but hampered by the continuing swarms of drones and the presence of an Octanian harvester leviathan. We'll keep you up to date as the situation develops. Bacon set. Bacon. Bacon? I shouldn't have skipped breakfast. Is that a wizard lizard or a lizard wizard? See you later, Magic Gator. Sam, I'm heading into Rome with Father Mikhail. We'll stay put until Project Rock and Roll goes live, and then we'll push for the Vatican. Copy that. Good luck, guys. Approaching target area. Looks suspiciously quiet. Need enemy contact. Lots of it. Guys, looks like we got zealots. Remember, Kitty, shoot them in the back. Yes, sir. Back shooting commencing. Sorry, I'm on duty. I can't get hammered. Beacon one set, heading for the stadium. You know, this place would be kind of nice if it weren't for all the monsters. I, I did it! Beacon set! Yeah, cause Sam gave you the easy ones. Ah, an authentic ancient Roman rocket launcher. Beacon 2 set. Looks like I ain't buying the drinks tonight. That's because I gave you the easy ones, dumbass. Beacon 2 set. Ready to... Hold on. I need to hand out some bullets. Sam, I can't raise Jones. It might be a comms malfunction, but... Can you pinpoint his bacon? Beacon? Yes, it's in the amphitheater, but it seems to be mobile. I'll check it out. I'm done as well. I can help you. Negative. I got this. Kenny, you get out of here. Hey, boss, you there yet? Getting a bit worried about Jones. Man's quiet. Not this quiet. Almost there.
reason I just don't approve of people eating my friends. Just a sec. He had a brother, you know. The guy you just killed? I'll have to call him, tell him some damn alien killed Tom. It'll ask me, what'd you do, Sam? And I'll say, I stuck this beacon right through that bastard alien skull. Do you think that'll make him feel better? Let's find out together. Sam, what's happening? Keep losing your signal. There's too much interference. All beacons are placed and primed. But we have to the perimeter. Just a minute to reach the minimum of safe distance. We are not outside the target area. We got confirmation from the ground. Engage the harp array. Sir, I'm not sure that's what Stone meant. Sam, please repeat, we're getting a lot of interference. I repeat, we have cleared the perimeter. We can't hesitate. Stone's a soldier. He knows the risks. Sir. Energize. That's an order. Confirmed. We have clearance from General Brand. Engaging Harp. Project Rock and Roll is a go. Crap. No, 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 no! Kenny? Yes, sir? Run! Sam, it's getting mighty toasty over here. Hurry up. Got Scorps here. Killed those Scorps. Hey, me too. Scorp buddies. The big Scorp has joined the little Scorps. Oh, I haven't seen a big one yet. Isn't that a good thing? But we were Scorp buddies. The moron who burns twice as bright dies twice as fast. Paraphrasing Lao Tzu, sir. That's elaborate. My one-liners go extra deep. Guys, get back to the car ASAP. But I'm having such a nice barbecue. What's your status, Sam? I'm on fire. Oh, OK. Sam, hurry up. It's hot enough to fry an egg on the hood. All right, all right. Damn, woman, now you made me think of breakfast again. Kenny, status. Still running. Everything's coming down. Had to take a detour. Ha! Ah! Kenny, you okay? I'm pinned, sir. Can't get out. Could use help. Hang on, kid. Sir. Oh, over here, sir. What happened to you? I got trapped under this statue of Uranus. That doesn't look like my- Let's not go there. You're right, I can do better. Thanks, kid. Now come on, we need to keep moving. Can you walk? I'll do my best. I can actually see the lava now. Looks dangerous. No, really? By the way, this type of situation, perfect for fire-based one-liners. Go ahead, give it a shot. But what if I fail? Will you 
fire me? No, of course not. I see what you did there. Well played. Okay, firing up the engine. The clock is ticking and melting. The metaphorical clock is actually melting. Oh no! It's one of Lord Ackerman's infamous witch brides! Yay! Hold still, damn it! Kenny! One liner! Uh... Abracadabra, lady! See, you're getting the hang of it, kid! Huh. Yes, I am. Get in the car. This place is going to hell. Jones? Didn't make it. Let's get out of here before we join you. out there stand down I'm not going to court-martial you for assaulting a superior officer but if you think I'll apologize stone think again being a leader means having to make tough calls even if people hate you for it I've accepted that burden but I also demand the respect that comes with it you want respect you don't leave people out to fry maybe one day you'll find yourself in my shoes and then you'll understand that pragmatism beats idealism any day of the week. But we have bigger problems now. Quinn? This discussion isn't over, sir. The plan worked. The raiders are down, but there's been... a hiccup. There's always a hiccup. Carter and Delta Team escorted Father Mikhail into Rome. They were on their way to the Vatican Library, but we lost contact with them at 1300 hours. Any idea why? Negative. They were in the catacombs when we lost comms. It could be equipment failure, but given the seismic activity in the area... You think they brought the house down? Figures. Their last known position was near the Colosseum. Enough talk. Take Rodriguez. Find them. Good luck, boys. Call me if you need backup. I'll be, uh, here too. A brain with a mouth. I guess it's hungry for new ideas. Pain makes me angry! Here they come! Weather's nice today. Nothing like a volcano to give your day that special something. Makes me feel like having a picnic. I can't believe Jones is gone, man. I hear ya. I always figured I'd go first. The heart attack while doing blow or in some dumb way like a, a helicopter crash or falling off a horse. Not in battle, obviously. I'm f***ing Rodriguez, but Jones, man. I thought he might make it. Go back to being a cook. Open up a taqueria or something. Not... Not this. Yo, boss, which way you want to go? City or ruins? I don't know. Quinn! Quinn? We f the volcano, and the volcano f the radio. Karma's a Okay, you take the city, I'll take the ruins. What is it with you and ruins? Oh, looky what I found. I don't know, Sam, what is it? It's a locked door. But you hate those, don't you, Sam? Yes, yes I do. And you know what? I bet Rodriguez won't run into a single one of these. Sit tight. I'm on my way. They're trapped. What else are they gonna do? The 
war to save the Earth has cost us many good friends. Here is a message from one of them, played at his request. My mom always said, don't speak unless you got something to say. But if you do, never shut up until you said it. But if you're hearing this, looks like the bad guys got me. But I still have something to say. I joined this fight knowing I would probably die. And that's okay, if it's the price for saving the planet. But I wanted you to know, to remember, that I didn't give my life for a nation, or a race, or a religion. I joined because I like people. Ordinary human beings of every type and flavor. Not presidents and generals. Not even artists and geniuses. Just ordinary old dumbass human beings. Doing their thing. That's it. That's enough. Remember that. Rest easy, soldier. We got this. Ah, the Colosseum. Where thousands of souls suffered under the scorching Roman sun. Well, at least we don't have tourism anymore. Well, well, well. The mighty hero has reached the grand arena to fight before the ruler of the land. Most appropriate, don't you think? A dramatic setting for the hero's final confrontation with reality. Is that what you call my fist meeting your face? <laughs> you see, that attitude is what makes conquering your planet so amusing. Your unwavering belief in the triumph of the underdog. I want to see that confidence break. You done talking, jackass? No, I'm only just getting started. How long before you run out of bullets, Sam? How long before there isn't a single bullet left on this entire planet? My fists don't need bullets. How many people have fought and died on this spot? How many human empires have come and gone? Conquest is inevitable, Sam. You're beginning to bore me. Let me summarize your final lesson, Sam. There is a hierarchy to the universe. People like you will always be down there. People like me will always be up here. And the only escape you have is death. Goodbye, Sam. Nobody will remember you. <laughs> Looks like Ackerman ordered the lobster, and I'm gonna have to pick up the tab. What a crap-tivating location for a big bat. And that's why a crustacean is like a- Damn it, Rodriguez, you interrupted my one-liner. Sorry, boss. You want me to go back down and come back up again? <sighs> no, the moment's passed. What are you doing down there anyhow? Been down here like half an hour. I think the others are that way. What happened to you? Ah, uh, you know, same old crab. All right, these guys have to be down here somewhere. This makes it... How many times now we've dug Carter out of a hole? Four, if you count the buried spaceship in Peru. What is it with this guy? Now I am confused. McCartney was dead all along? Oh yeah, you got it, Father. Mental replaced him with a highly modified Aludrin Reptiloid just before Sergeant Pepper. And Elvis? Alive and kicking. I see. And what has that got to do with our Lord and Savior, Jesus of Nazareth? Now, 
If you analyze the book of Revelations using the Rohan's Codex cipher with a reference to the Voynich manuscript, you get the lyrics to Hound Dog, and of course they call him the king. <laughs> Coincidence? I think not. I... I don't even know what to say. Sweet! Carter found someone to play with. Yeah, sorry you got stuck down here with Carter, Padre. Oh no, not at all. Our conversation was most illuminating. Okay, Rodriguez, you dig him out. I'll take care of the rest. Father, just tell me how to get that thingamajig. We are actually looking for text, not Ark of Covenant. Text leads us to Ark. What's this Ark, anyway? A holy container described in Book of Exodus. A box. A box that, according to my research, contains Holy Grail. And that will help us defeat Metal. How? Grail has power to heal all ills. With it, we can withstand this false god's assault on our planet. Music to my ears. Where do I find this text? When you get to Chamber of Nephilim in Vatican Library, you must find statue of St. George. Hold down his sigil while turning his right arm in perpendicular direction. Then push his left arm upwards and secret chamber containing document will be revealed. Sigil, that's a nice word. I should have a sigil. The sigil of Sam. Sam, are you listening to me? Relax, Chamber of St. George, push the sigil, yada yada, I got it. You, Americano, come here. Ma'am, what are you doing here? This is a war zone. This is not a war zone. This is Roma, my city, my home. I fight. Ma'am, there are more of them coming. It would be best if... What is it, Americano? Are you afraid of monsters? Ma'am, I'm a... Don't be afraid. Nuna's right here. She help you fight the monsters. Americano, you fight on street like a good boy. I shoot from here. <sighs> My old bones are no good for the close combat. What is it about grannies that makes them so hard to disobey? Death to alien fascisti! Americano, I'm proud of you. I must go get my rocket launcher now. Here, you take Nona's minigun. <gasps> Careful, it is heavy. Thanks, I've actually handled one of these before. Uh, uh, by the way, how do I get to the Vatican? Oh, it's easy. Go around the Castello and then turn left through the park. Go straight ahead, and there you can find Papa Mobile. I, I'm, I'm not sure that's my kind of ride. <laughs> Silly boy. is the new Papa Mobile. Il Papa have it made all special. You see, he's good. Now go. Oh, yes! Thanks, crazy old Italian lady, and thank you, Mr. Pope! And on the eighth day, the Lord gave unto Sam a mech, and it was good. Oh, pretty.
loading ammunition. Specialized in progress. Complete. All systems ready. Let God sort them out. Okay, let's get that book. What did Father Mikhail say? Find the statue of Saint... what was it? John? Paul? Ringo? George! Right. Now, turn to... what the hell is a sigil anyway? I don't even... Ah, screw it. This should do it. So, an old Slavic text we found in Italy told us that the Middle Eastern artifact we're looking for, which is actually of alien origin, is in France. Yep. This is actually one of our less convoluted missions. You sure it's in Carcassonne, then? I am sure it is there, but I am not sure our path is wise. This grail, whatever it is, I fear it is anathema unto God. Men died to hide it, to shield the world from its influence. Or to keep it for themselves. Whatever their reasons, we need it. We're gonna win this war, no matter the cost. And what if cost is our soul? I'll write them a check. Five minutes to drop. What's the situation on the ground? Oh, Catfu. Mental captured the town a while back. We can expect heavy enemy activity. Nice. I like a challenge. You're set to rendezvous with a French resistance cell. Contact's name is Michelle. She'll meet you on the main square. The resistance will get you into the castle. What was that? What the f Lost engine two! Kremlins are real! We got raiders on our tail! This thing flies like a sack of potatoes! A sack of potatoes that's about to fall out of the sky! Start bailing, now! You heard the lady. Go! Geronimo! What the f Everyone, report! I'm okay! I got out. I lost my shoe! Winds are too strong. Can anyone hear me? Try to stay together. Don't get scattered. We're... Guys, hello? I can't see anything. Is that a tree? Hello? Anyone there? Quinn? Carter? Kenny? Sam? Kenny, that you? Damn radio. Might as well be carrying a can on a piece of string. 
Namaste, mon frère. Have you come to be taken and become one with Mother Nature? What? They have come from the stars to put us back in touch with the Earth. Is there like another set of alien invaders that I'm not aware of? No, 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 they are not invaders. Look, I will show you. Oh, no. Come, let us celebrate the dawn of Aquarius. Help us change ourselves so we can change the world. Take us up in your divine chariots and teach us the path of peace. Yeah, about that. You might want to take cover. Huh? Oh, oh no! Oh, I have made a terrible mistake! They are invaders! No, really? They are evil astral imperialists! Kill them all! Rearrange their chakras with your fists! Ah, I can see in your aura that you are a powerful friend of the Earth. Now, mon frère, it is time to seek out their base and bring peace. By crushing the oppressor, you must head there, to the south, as the eagle flies. But you cannot go on foot like a hobbit. You will need a mighty steed. Here, take the keys to my combine harvester. You're a terrible hippie. You know that? Well, you have to go with the flow, mon frere. <laughs> Can you dig it? Like a grave. Oh, wow, that came out really sinister. Anyway, bye, hippie dude. Happy trails, mon frere. Let's see what this thing can do. Over a bunch of aliens. talking about. Let's check it out. Sam, do you read me? Barely. You okay, kid? Nothing I can't handle, sir. I don't know where the others are, though. Should I look for them? Negative. Head for the town. We'll regroup there. Yes, sir. Oh, and... I'm heading for the town. Took out a bunch of Gnar. Gnar? Gnars? Wait, what's the plural? This is Bill Corwin with a bulletin for our listeners in southern France. According to a message from the French Resistance, one of their agents was captured by Mental and forced to reveal the itinerary of a relief convoy currently en route to Montclair on the D-6113. EDF personnel and courageous civilians in the Carcassonne region are encouraged to render assistance if possible. We're all in this together, folks. Sir, I'm approaching the town. No sign of the others. I I'll wait for you at the bridge. There's the bridge. Let's find Kitty. Sir, over here. Hey, kid. How's France treating you? Oh, sir, you wouldn't believe the things I had to fight to get here. But here you are. See, kid? You got this. Yes, sir. I believe I do got this. <sighs> That's not right, is it? So, kid, you feel like you're part of the team now? Yes, sir. I'm sure I'll be snorting drugs with Rodriguez, flying planes with Hellfire, and... Uh, what... what does Carter do, exactly? We're not sure. Classified. I hope we find that damn Grail soon. Maybe the real Grail was the friends we made along the way. You've gotten a lot better at this, kid. Thanks! It helps that I have a gun!
That was a good fight, kid. Kenny? Hello again, Sam. Kenny! Look who I found. Let him go, you scumbag. Or what? Or I'm gonna put a bullet in your head. Oh, Sam, Sam, Sam. Let me deconstruct this for you. You are not only outnumbered, but outdated. A relic from a time when people believed in heroes and causes and uh, freedom. But deep down, you know, you must know, these ideas are myths, bedtime stories for little boys, and you can never win. The might of Tarhum will crush this world, as it has crushed every other that stood against him. You can't save the Earth, Sam. No matter how many of our soldiers you kill, no matter how many witty one-liners you come up with, you can't even save your closest friends. Let's settle this right here, just you and me. Man to whatever you are, leave the kid out of it. And why would I do that? Why in the world would I do that when I can just do this? No! No, 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 no! There goes another hero. Come back here! Come back here, you son of a... Damn it, Kenny. Sorry, I... I wish, ah, uh, you know, I, I, I'm not good at this crap. Well, would you look at that? At least you got both your shoes. That's something, isn't it? Stone, over here. Rest easy, kid. I am sorry to be meeting you under such circumstances. My name is Said. I will take you to the resistance. This way, mon ami. Comrades, this man has come from far away to join our fight. I know we do not always love the Americans, but today we do not fight for France, or Algeria, or America. We fight for Earth! So listen carefully. I shall say this only once. We must get to the castle. I know we have lost many good people trying, but our informant has found another way. I will not lie to you. This may be our final mission, but I say it will be worth it! What do you say, Samstone? I don't usually do big epic speeches. That's more of a general brand thing, but I just lost a good friend and I think he'd like me to say something inspiring. So here goes. We're gonna storm that castle. We're gonna get that grail. We're gonna kill Ackerman, and we're gonna win this goddamn war. Viva la resistance! Viva la resistance! I did not know you spoke French. I don't. I heard that in a movie. your friend. I lost friends to Ackerman, too. I'll make him pay for all of them. Oui, I will tell you. Your teammates landed south of the town. We have sent someone to show them the way to the castle. They'll meet us there, if nothing goes wrong. Of course, something always goes wrong. Tell me about it. Are you impressed by the wide variety of local artisan and monsters? Yeah, it's okay. It's okay? Really? We have more mummies than Egypt! There are 13 mummies per inhabitant now. We have so many mummies, one of them ran for mayor. Wonder what I'll do when I find the grail. I would suggest a nice cheese, some flambéed acrima, and a good wine. Red or white? That depends on whether he tastes like chicken. Uh, mon ami, you will not believe the things we have experienced here in Carcassonne. Just last week we had to kill 
It's like on. Yeah, I shot a unicorn once. I told you he would not be impressed. Stone, we need to go down here. As you can see, we are not called an underground movement for nothing. Uh, okay. So, how long is this gonna take? What? Get down! No, don't! Give me one good reason. This is our informant. He's what? What? Are you sure? Please, human, remain calm. We are not all servants of Tahum the Mad. It is only the fanatics who consider him a god. I am not one of them. Uh, okay. Human, do you want to go to the castle or not? No time to argue. We need to go. So, uh, awkward? What's your name? I am called Chagak Zalma Gakiak. Can I call you Charlie? Ah, that is what my brood mother called me when I was but a hatchling. So how'd you end up on Earth, Charlie? Like all conquerors, it is Tahun's way to ally himself with the very worst people in each civilization. On my home planet, he supported a faction of religious fanatics. They were... How do you say? Black Hacks, in English. Traitors? Assholes. He helped them destroy the High Council of Scorpius, ruined thousands of years of culture. When they started drafting young arachnoids for his army, the Resistance saw an opportunity to sabotage Tahum's operations from the inside. Cool. Charlie, my friend. Can you help us settle this? Is there not a very large variety of monsters here? It is... okay. See? That's what I said. It is of course nothing compared to the plains of Tupu, where I once killed a double-ended Obanian hypersnake. How do you do that? Simple! You strangle it at both ends. Here, let me get that for you. Charlie, I can't wait for you to meet my buddy, Carter. Now, when you get talking, I want you to tell him that your people faked the moon landing. Ah! A jest! I am known for my love of practical jokes. Once in the... Raiders! Take cover! I'll take care of this Drakrax flyboy! Don't worry, Charlie. It happens to the best of us. They must have realized we're pushing for the castle. They're throwing everything they got at us. Sit tight. I'm coming. No, this is too important. You must go ahead. We will distract them. Good luck, Stone. Luck has nothing to do with it. Guns. Guns have everything to do with it. Come, my friends! Let us show Tahum that the free peoples of the galaxy stand together! Carter, is that you? Uh, Sam, can you hear me? Carter, hello? Sam? I, I don't think he can hear me. Well, that went nowhere. So, you see, Father, the black helicopters were causing the chemtrails all along, just like Nostradamus predicted. But, uh... Was piloting black helicopters. Oh, well, you see, after the Illuminati sent Blizzard Stanley Kubrick into space to fake the second moon landing, the Knights Templar came up with a plan. Sam, we're coming up on the castle. Hey, what's that over there? I don't know, but I want to kill it. <sighs> They're having all the fun. <laughs> Time for another editorial. What does Lord Aquaman believe in? We know what we're fighting for, but what is he all about? Well, here's the thing. 
If you spend some time listening to all that hot air the drones are spewing, you'll realize there's not a whole lot there. Except that he would really like it if we just gave up and died. Well, right back at you, Ackerman. Just because you took a correspondence course in philosophy 101 doesn't mean that we need to be impressed with you. At the end of the day, it's not about words, but about actions. And all the fancy words in the world can't hide what you are. Just another conqueror. Sam, can you hear us? Just about. Where are you? Big castle, top of the hill. Can't miss it. Can you be more specific, son? No idea. It all looks the same to me. Just head for the gunfire. Father, did I tell you about how lizards rule the world? Rule if you mean dinosaurs. Although I thought you said they were hoax. No, no, I meant rule. Most of our leaders are descendants of lizard people from the planet Sirius. Didn't you tell me that world was ruled by Illuminati? Yeah, I... Uh, I haven't quite worked that out. Keep moving. That Ark isn't gonna find itself. Ha! And y'all can tell your mamas I don't even like pinching seafood! Do I even want to know? Don't just make it polite conversation, boss. You find Kenny? He's, uh... He's gone. Damn. He was just a kid. His soul is with his creator now. Hey, there you are. I was getting worried about you. I'm fine. I wasn't worried about you, jackass. Anyhow, I saw some goodies on my way here. Sam, you want to go resupply? Hmm. Father, let's talk resurrection. Are you about to tell me they cloned Jesus? Don't feed the conspiracy theorist, Father. More like conspiracy terrorists. Yeah. Make fun of me for questioning things. I, I mean, next you'll be telling me that global warming wasn't an inside job. Shit, talking to you makes my brain hurt. Well, that's just my words expanding your neurons. Did that conversation make any sense? I don't know. I try not to listen. When I said an eye for an eye, this is not what I imagined. You want to know the truth? I am reloading. There is Basilica. Grail will be inside. Just the murderous I was looking for. How lovely to see you again, Sam. And how nice of you to bring your friends. So I can take care of all of you in one go. But you should know that I feel a kind of gratitude. You taught me something about this planet, Sam. It's loud and garish and annoying and surprisingly hard to kill. And that's precisely why it needs to die. It's a disease. And after I've killed you, Sam, I'm going to do my very best to wipe out every single... What's with the legs? Oh, yeah. I've been thinking that the whole time. Why are they so tiny? They're freaking me out. I told you they were super weird. Never ask questions when you're not ready for the answers. How very ominous. Yeah, it's never good when that happens. He'll probably come out as a four-armed giant or something. Nope, he's a butterfly. Let's waste this Kenny Kelly Pendejo lizard! You said it, brother. Sam, save your ammo! The skin's too thick! Is he... mating 
with his cocoon? What the f***, Ackerman? Come at me! Come at me, mother It's all you can eat at the Mexican buffet, and I'm bringing the habaneros! What does that even mean? It means your f*** is gonna burn! The hero has defeated the villain. And now what? A one-liner? The perfect manifestation of empty human wit? Maybe a pun? An attempt to ignore the howling abyss with a ridiculous construct of macho verbiage? What will it be, Sam? With what hollow words will you immortalize this momentary triumph? I lost my shoe. What? That's hardly... Deconstruct that. You, my friend, are mad. But sometimes there is something divine about your madness. Just doing my job, Father. Now let's get that Grail and get out of here. Samuel, I am certain now it is not Grail. Grail was intended to heal wounds of the world. This is something else. We came all this way. Let's at least have a look. Now what? We must perform ritual. But I think it is unwise. Listen, Padre. If you don't want to do it, me and my friend C4 can always do it our way. No, 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 no. That, that's fine. Please don't. My way's faster. It may be Catholic heresy, but I feel bad enough that we blew up Vatican. Hmm, let's see. Avert the judgment of the saint. Avert the judgment. Ah. Blind the divine messenger. Invoke the mark of Saint Peter. Peter was crucified upside down. The Ark. I can feel its power. Ah, here's hoping it doesn't melt my face off. It's a stick. Do not touch it. This artifact was placed in the Ark to shield the world from its evil. He's right. Don't touch it. What the hell? Stand down, Stone. We're taking over from here. Brand, what are you doing? Sir, we succeeded. This is the artifact. Why are these pendejos pointing their guns at us? Oh, you people. You were so dumb. This whole planet. Oh, sheep. No wonder mental is winning. You believe anything you're told. I didn't even need to invent General Brand. You already believed in him. He's that tough old bastard who doesn't play by the rules. But if we trust him, he'll do what needs to be done. So you sold us out. I recognize the true order of things. It's time for me to be on the winning side. Humanity had its chance. They should have joined Mighty Tahum, like the Kanum and the older races did. I will present this offering 
And the power that lies within it has a tribute to our Lord Tahum the Magnificent. And they say I'm insane. Huh. I'm not insane. I'm just a pragmatist. There's a hierarchy to the universe, and I'm about to get a promotion. For these the soldiers of darkness. For we struggle not against flesh and blood, but against Ugh, powers and principles. Silence, priest! Do you fear the word of God? <laughs> what does your God say now, Father? He says... You. I'm gonna kick your so hard you can kiss your own ass. Son of a... I want this one gift-wrapped. And the others? Feed them to the drones. Who's awake? Harder to process than you think. Ha! <laughs> I doubt it. Seriously, though, Sam, it's a good deal. You'll have a much better life as Mental's pet than if you stay on this planet. No thanks. I gotta go. Things to do, people to kill. But don't worry, we'll meet again. I promise. Finally, I get lucky. Now, I just need to get into the water. Uh, maybe it's still okay? Or not. Another boat! Beautiful! Okay, listen. You just stay up there until I come get you. Hey! Did you guys hear I killed Ackerman? Guess they did. Skipper's log. 
Heading for Tunguska to prevent a mutated general from handing over an alien artifact to an evil super being from outer space. So, basically Tuesday. Now what? Huh? Strange things are afoot in the Arctic Circle. Hey, Sam! Who are you? I'm you, from the future. It's complicated, just roll with it. Eh, it's not the weirdest thing that's happened this week. Listen up, your team's safe. Hellfire took care of that, but that weasel brand has the grail and is headed for the portal now. In this version of the timeline, you landed too far to the east. But don't worry, I got you covered. Thanks, buddy. Good to know I have my back. What can I say? We're a great guy. Sir, the pyramid is done charging. All right, I'm coming. That was... interesting. Quinn, I need a route to the portal. Sam? I, I thought you were dead. I got better. What happened? This thing doesn't have GPS. No, I meant to you. What happened to you? Oh, the usual stuff. Got drugged on a train, jumped from a plane, talked to my future self, and now I don't know how to get to Tunguska. I... I don't even... <sighs> okay. Okay, give me a sec. Thanks, Quinn. Always a pleasure. is non-standard use of vehicle. Fly me to the noom. I do not understand. No? How about, uh, don't lose your head? You confuse me. Is this joke? Okay, soldier. You have no sense of humor. Which way to the big battle? Thanks. Have a nice day. It is not likely. This is Bill at Radio Free Earth with a thought for today. You know, we humans, we've spent the last few millennia constantly at war with one another. And to be perfectly honest, most of it for really dumb reasons. It's actually quite tragic. But maybe we can turn it around. Maybe it means something. Because now, now we have to fight. And if there's one positive thing about all these thousands of years of fighting, it's this. We've gotten really good at it. You hear that, Mental? This is one hell of a badass planet. And Why does you're everyone not think they are a comedian? Corwin out. Sam, are you on foot? What happened to the snowmobile? Had to ditch it in a canoe's face. Ah. Hurry up, or you'll miss all the fun! I'm working on it! Don't worry, I'll save you a few. You should be able to make radio contact with the others soon. Sam, it is imperative that you stop General Brandt. The artifact he has stolen contains a powerful neutrino generator. Its neutron flux capacity is unparalleled. It must not fall into Mental's hands. I have no idea what you just said. You must kill General Brandt. Now that I understand. Hey, who started the party without me? You're late. Good to have you back, boss. Sam, I'm sending you the coordinates to a resupply point. I suggest you head there. You say the cleverest things. I know. General? 
Not yet, but I bet he's around somewhere. Holy Grail. Yep. That thing's gonna blow! Yep. Hey, boys. Did you miss me? You're right on time. Wanna go for a ride? Say hi to the big fella. You betcha. Open wide.
That went straight to his head. I would have said, don't lose your head. I already did that one today. That was one hell of a migraine. This is getting very cerebral. Things came to a head. Brain drain is a serious issue. Talk about a head rush. I guess he couldn't get it out of his head. No, no, wait, I got it. We blew his mind. Perfect. Yep, that's the one. I hate it when I come up with the right one-liner five minutes after I kill the monster. Yeah, it's the worst. The life so short, the craft so long to learn. I had pun block for a week once. It's uh, never happened to me. You think this is the end? Do you think you've won? You have no idea what Tahum is capable of. He will destroy this planet, and nothing. Just in case. Oh, and uh, by the way, tell Mental, Earth says hi. And then I jumped out of the plane right over the Arctic Ocean. And you survived how? He's serious, Sam? That is not an explanation. I'm Rodriguez the Ram. When I jumped off a hooker's bicycle, I broke my pelvis. No, there's a theory that states... Oh, God, not again. It's not a theory when some whack job just comes up with some random stuff, Carter. Anyone can do that. I can do it. Dogs invented the moon. My grandmother was a reptiloid. Sam is a time traveler. Uh, yeah, that'd be crazy. There's a hypothesis. So, how did you guys escape from the harvester? Oh, it was so badass. It was gross. They tried to probe us. <laughs> what? Nobody tried to probe me. Me neither. Carter, I think they singled you out. Did you tell them one of your theories? Sorry, I mean hypotheses. Well, you would have been next. They went after me first because of my intel. Yeah, keep telling yourself that. <laughs> that was a long mission. Oh, yeah. At least we got to see the sights. You know, Rome was pretty cool. Especially the Vatican. You know, before Sam blew it up. Hey, I only blew up part of it. France was awesome. But I'm part French, you know, I'm biased. You're part French, too? Of course. French is the language of love. And I am all about the loving. Ew. Yo, pass me the marshmallows. Rodriguez ate them all. Damn it. Let's call Quinn and order more. You know, she's a communications officer, not your personal assistant. We're out of beer. Damn it. Quinn, we need more beer. Hey, you remember when Kenny lost his shoe? Poor Kenny. He was a good kid. I wish Father Mikhail was here. So you could torture the poor man with your theories? Well, I choose to believe that he enjoyed our conversations. Man, I wish we could kill Brand some more. How many times have we saved the Earth now? I don't know, like seven, eight? Are we counting Beijing? Definitely. What about Oslo? I don't think that counts. 
Plus, you ran over that nun. I keep telling you guys, she came out of nowhere. How many more times do you think we can pull this off, saving the planet? As many as we have to. No way we're all gonna make it. Speak for yourself. Well, whoever's left at the end will have to find a way. There's always a way. Sometimes it requires dynamite, but it's always there. Wow, that got dark fast. I got beer. Quinn, you came. Beer, you came. You are my personal assistant. Oh, shut up, Hellfire. A toast. Let's raise our beers in memory of absent friends. To Jones. Miss you, buddy. To Father Mikhail. I hope they let you take your shotgun into heaven. To Kenny. You were just getting the hang of it. So, where do you think they'll send us next? Someplace warm would be nice. But not too humid. How about Egypt? Americano. Nana, I have a mission for you. <laughs> Silly boy. Let's do this. 